Welcome back to GP Nail Art. I am Jessica. Today I am doing some flannel nails. On my left hand I have my first attempt at a French tip style mani and I will put that video in the cards uh, for you up in the corner. And as you can see I already did some practice of the flannel nail art. Uh, but the red dip powder I used is satin from Rebel Nails and it's a real nice Christmassy red. Also you can see my nails already look shiny and that's because I've applied the gel base coat and after curing it does keep a sticky layer which is going to help the stamp transfer over to the nail. Uh, but Manny Allergy does also have a sticky base coat available. Uh, the stamping polishes I am using today are black and green. Uh, the black is called Straight Up Black and that's number B171. And the green is Pine number B298. On my stamping plate I'm only going to use half of this stamp with the line so that I can make the red square in the middle bigger for that flannel kind of a look. The plate is M013, and the other supplies that I like to have close by are my 100% acetone and my cotton rounds to clean the plate, the ice cube stamper and scraper, and a lint roller to clean the stamper. So I'm going to start right in on the stamping. Again, I'm only applying the polish to half of the stamp. I'm going to use a slight rolling motion to pick up the stamp and then use the lint roller to clean any parts off of the stamper that I don't like or that don't need to be there. And I do also want to let you know that I have an affiliate code with Maniology. I will go ahead and put that up on the screen for you as well as have it listed in the description box below and that will give you 10% off of your regular purchases and I do also make a small commission with that so if you do choose to use it I thank you for your support but if you don't that's quite all right as well. <laughs> so when I was practicing the flannel nail art you will see in the ending pictures at the end of the video that on my thumb the green and the black kind of intertwine, almost like a basket weave. Um, the green is kind of above and below the black. I sent a picture <laughs> to my mother and my sister asking how they liked it. Well, <laughs> my sister proceeded to school me on what a proper flannel should look like and that the colors, the colors should not intertwine. They should all be above or all below the other color. <laughs> And then she sent me a few hundred pictures of flannel shirts. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> but uh, I said, no problem. I'll do it right on the other fingers. But, uh, you know, how should I know? I don't have any flannels. I live in Florida. <laughs> but it was all in fun. <laughs> anyway, I will also put a video in the cards that goes into a little bit more detail about how I stamp and the process, um, but I will go ahead and let you watch for now.
I am back. Uh, right now, I'm not going to worry about the polish that's on my skin. I'm going to apply my gel top coat, and I do cure this for 60 seconds. And once that's applied and cured, it's not going to get ruined by a little swipe of uh, acetone, so I will uh, clean up the mess on my cuticles and on my skin uh, after I cure. So I'm also going to apply a matte finish uh, because although I don't own any flannels, I do know that they're not shiny. <laughs> um, this matte finish is from Revlon. I think that I got that on Amazon, but you could probably get it at any of your grocery or drugstores as well. I did the gel top coat first because sometimes just using matte coat, it can look a little bit streaky when it dries and doing either a gel top coat or even any other regular top coat underneath the mat is going to keep that from happening. But I'll let you watch and I'll be back for the end of the video.
I am back and I'm using my Candy Skin Care Cuticle Oil Pen on this Manny, although I'm going to carefully apply it to my skin and try to not get any on the nail. That's because uh, it's going to look shiny again if it gets on the nail. But if that does happen, if you're using a matte finish, you can just swipe your nails with a little bit of alcohol on a paper towel, and that'll get that matte finish back for you. Well, let me know what you think of the flannel nails, of the stamping. Uh, please like uh, the video. Don't forget to, to, uh, sorry, to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And until next time, bye for now.